The president made this shocking announcement just a few hours ago on Twitter, writing the first lady and I have tested positive for COVID-19. We will begin our quarantine and recovery process immediately. We will get through this together. And this news really sending shockwaves across social media this morning. And the hashtag Trump has COVID is the number one story trending around the globe. So here's what we know so far. There were concerns late last night after the president revealed that one of his aides, Hope Hicks, had tested positive for COVID-19. Reports say Hicks felt sick while she was here in Minnesota earlier this week and quarantined on Air Force One, which prompted tests for both the president and the first lady. The White House released this statement from President Trump's physician confirming that both he and Melania tested positive. The memo reads in part, the president and first lady are both well at this time and they plan to remain at home within the White House during their convalescence. Now, the first lady also tweeted early this morning that both she and the president are both feeling good. She writes, I have postponed all upcoming engagements. Please be sure you are staying safe and we'll all get through this together. Vice President Mike Pence tweeting that he and his wife send their love and prayers and quote, join millions across America praying for their full and swift recovery. And various world leaders are reacting to this news, including British Prime Minister Boris Johnson, who also contracted the virus back in April and had a nearly two week long battle with COVID. He tweeted my best wishes to President Trump and the First Lady. Hope they both have a speedy recovery from the coronavirus. And of course, as this is developing, Gia, and more and more people are starting to wake up, I'll keep you posted on any new developments. But really huge, shocking news for yeah. a lot of people to wake up to this morning. Exactly. If you went to sleep early, I mean, this is what everyone is talking about today. So um, we'll have much more on this coming up. Alicia, thank you.